Welcome to SI Tutorials. Today, I'll guide you through the simple steps to upgrade your Fresh Tomato firmware from version 2024.2 to 2024.3. First, visit the Fresh Tomato website and download the latest firmware update as highlighted on the router's page. Before you proceed with the upgrade, it's crucial to back up your current configuration. This ensures that if anything goes wrong during the update, you won't lose your settings. Next, access the upgrade menu in your Fresh Tomato interface. Find the firmware file you just downloaded and extract it. Once you've selected it, initiate the upgrade process. Your router will automatically reboot once the upgrade is complete. And that's it, you've successfully upgraded your firmware. Now, let's go over some of the key changes in the 2024.3 update. This update brings a range of important improvements and security patches. Core libraries like LibSpig Turbo, LibXML2, SQLite, and LibCurl have been updated to the latest versions, ensuring better performance and stability. Jinx has been upgraded to version 1.27.0, providing enhanced security and faster web serving capabilities. OpenSSL has seen significant updates, with both the 3.0 and 1.1 versions receiving patches for multiple security vulnerabilities. OpenVPN has been updated to version 2.5.11, offering improved VPN performance and security. Additionally, there are updates to other critical components such as PPTPD, Wolfsoul, and many of it. On the interface side, there are several refinements, including an improved layout for the network and QoS pages, and enhanced functionality in the wireless survey tool, which now allows filtering by frequency and sorting by signal strength. There's also a new internet connectivity test integrated into the ad block feature, making it more reliable. These updates, along with numerous other tweaks and fixes, ensure that your Fresh Tomato router remains secure, efficient, and user-friendly. Thank you for watching this tutorial on SI Tutorials. If you found this guide helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials like this. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of our future updates. See you in the next video.